Hello guys, I'm back. It's only me though. No, no, this time. Um, but uh, it's Minecraft 13w17a, and I wanted to start a new Minecraft Let's Play with just me. Um, if you've been wondering why um, our we may contain nuts, you know, our uh, self-named series is, hasn't been coming out as much is because uh, Noah's uh, internet, like his service provider, seems to be throttling the service for some reason. So uploads have been, like, slowing down his computer and stuff. And then, like, whenever he leaves, upload speeds are so slow. Or s That's what it seems like. And uh, we just haven't gotten around to uploading it. I'm assuming, uh, would it be episode 12, 11 or 12 will be out at the, uh, beginning of the month, so expect a new one for you, um, loyal few viewers that we have so far, um, at the beginning of May. Anyways, I am going to make this new world called Grosty, and so we'll see, um, yeah, cheats will be on just for, you know, the sake if we ever need it. But, yeah, let's get into this. Um, I'm kind of quiet right now. It's getting late. I had a long day. It's 10.45, though. And we spawned in a taiga. Let's look around. Oh, iron and coal. Sweet! Okay, but anyway, yeah, it's getting late. And I had a soccer game today, and it was, it was just really tiring, so... Even though it's, uh, even though I seem to usually be obnoxious, kind of just worn out today. That soccer game, we won 11 to 1 today. I had two goals. Uh, one was a volley, and one was a like a failed cross attempt that actually went in, so it was actually better than the cross. But uh, they're both pretty sweet. And uh, yeah, so I had a pretty good day, but it's still pretty tiring. Okay, I'll make a crafting bench and get straight into this bad boy. And get this coal and crap. Uh, anyways, um, it is the new snapshot, which means horses and all a bunch of new features like carpet and stuff is out. Which I'm not too keen on the idea of having a new mob like horses in the game, but you know, it, it still looks interesting, so I decided to go ahead and try it out now. But, uh, once you guys, if you haven't tried it, uh, you, you guys, um, let me know what you think about horses and, you know, like, the new game play style, I guess, if that's what you want to call it. Um, and tell me if you like it or not, and uh, that'll really get, or help me able to, help me to be able to see if I'm not the only one who doesn't like horses. There we go. I couldn't spit that out properly. It's so late. But I still wanted to bring this out because I was excited. So yeah. Alright, we're going to get this coal in about 15 stone just to set us up with a few stone tools and a uh, furnace after we get this set of coal here. And then we'll go get the iron after that. So yeah, that's the agenda for now. Anyway, in this series, guys, um, my main objective is to, not necessarily, well, not necessarily my main objective, but, um, my housing will be in the ground, I, well, not, uh, either in the side of a mountain or underground, um, I didn't really want to go with the house style just to mix it up this time, uh, and, uh, I don't know if, um, my first night hidey hole will be my permanent home or not. But, eventually, a uh, hole in the ground will end up being my home that I will expand on and make boss style. So, yeah. Okay, let's put our crafting bench and our furnace, once we craft it down, right over next to the crafting table here. And uh, we will make a few more sticks for torches also. That was weird. Sometimes this... Uh, crafting table seems to glitch out on me. We'll make 20 torches for now. And that'll leave us four coal, and we can cook whatever iron we find. 
But that right now is going to be the main objective, is to find iron and explore the area with what time we have in this day and get a few sheeps. So yeah. Anyway, it looks like there's a good cave system around here, so right after I make that, we will go exploring. Yeah, and I heard a skelly. That's not good. Never good. Ah. Ooh! Oh, creeper. No, I'm not going down there. No foods. Ill prepared. This is looking interessante. Lava flow just below the surface. Ooh. That looks nice, but I'm ill prepared to go search that out also. And that just looks like it goes back up to the surface, most likely. Yes. Okay. We might want to go a little deeper just for, you know, the sake of finding a little more iron a little bit quicker. So let's go back up here. It looked like there was a little branch over here, which there was. Let's light this up just a teeny bit. We have two directions. I think we'll go this way, though. And there's a lot of doggies outside. Like a boss. Um... Doesn't look like there's anything over here. Hopefully we can at least get enough iron to make a pickaxe. That'll really be awesome. But if not, I guess we can settle down for the first day. And uh, just get our sheeps and stuff. Maybe a little bit more wood. And that'll be good enough. I'll get this mushroom too. So, uh... What do you guys think about if you watch soccer, which I'm pretty big on that nowadays, but uh, I don't know if you guys heard, which it's kind of old news by now, maybe a few days old, but uh, any of you Liverpool pa fans out there, Luis Suarez biting Ivanovic, I think it's hilarious yet really, you know, just like out of control at the same time. I think you know, most people would think that anyway, but, like, this dude, a 10-match ban, I think, you know, just seeing as to how Liverpool obviously have no chance at the title now, because, you know, Man U sealed it up against Aston Villa, um, I think they should have just, instead of a 10-match ban, I think they should have just banned him for the rest of the season, if they're, unless... The rest of the season is only 10 matches. That's the only thing I don't know about. But um, if there is more than 10 matches in the uh, BPL season, then I would just say ban them for the rest of it. Because I think that's a little ridiculous. There is no need to let your frustrations out in a bite. Especially in sports. I mean, it's not like you're a little kid anymore, Suarez. You're, you know, what, 25 years old or something. That's just pretty ridiculous in my opinion. So, let me know what you guys think. Ten match ban, more uh, more games, less games. Let me know down in the comments below. I'd like to see your guys' opinions. For any of you guys that actually do watch us. Because I know we're still a small channel. Oh, sheepies! Yay! I don't want to have to cut you up. I want the shears, but I don't have any iron. I'm sorry, guys. This really hurts. Okay, I won't, I'll spare you. I've got three wool. Um, I think it's actually time to get back to the little cave over there. Because we are already starting to run out of food. Which is not good. But we have five piggy porks. Which is very good. So, yeah. <laughs> okay, let us go back. And get our first pork chops into our system. That'll taste really good. Really good. I think, if I'm not mistaken, I did switch. Yes. My classic skin. My remix slime. Evil Israel style. I love it. Um... If any of you guys want it, I can see if I can make a link for a download, if you guys like it. 
I've gotten some, uh, some, whatchamacallit, some requests, um, for a few of my skins. Some of my skins are really weird, but at the same time, they're pretty cool. Um, I use Skin Edit to make them, which is kind of outdated, I think, by now. Maybe not. I haven't used it in a long time, but, um, I did make a pig and a cow mix, and it looks like it's starting to become nighttime, maybe? I don't know. Maybe. Let us check. But anyway, yeah, and the pig, like, I made it to the best of my abilities, of my abilities, um, just, I didn't really have a lot of, uh, a lot of stuff to work with, because the pictures, um, they gave me, you know, like, enough, uh, detail, or, you know, well, obviously they give you enough detail that they're coming off the skins of the animals, but, um, the colors in MC Edit, or, not MC Edit, Derp, uh, Skin Edit, they just, I don't know what it is, there's not a huge variety, I guess, to them, like, um, a lot of the, uh, skins are very, like, similar in color, or, uh, a lot of the, uh, like, s take for instance cows, this, I just kind of jambled up there, but please excuse that, I'm tired, anyway, take for instance cows, you know how their main color is obviously brown, um, when I looked at the picture of the cows, there were very many different varieties of brownish colors in there that skin edit didn't have to offer. So I couldn't really make it totally perfect, but it was good enough. But the other problem um, came when I found out that the uh, you couldn't make individual sides of the skins, m meaning that say if you made the front side of one arm uh what looked like a pig then the other front side of the arm had to be pig which means you couldn't do like a half and half skin which was really unfortunate because the skin was pretty cool i made it for a uh admin on a server that i'm also admin for that hasn't been up recently, but it, it was still a pretty cool server, I gotta say. I'm still friends with the guys that um, run it. And it, it might still be up, but uh, look up, if you uh, if you want to check out some servers, look up Aimcraft. Um, if it's still up, uh, the last um, address I had for the server was Aimcraft. That a2g.gs, I believe, but I don't think it's been up in a while. But if it is, please check it out. It's really a pretty cool server whenever JC's not screwing things up. Um, but yeah, so that's the end of day one, guys. I actually did get a bed to kind of make it easy on myself. But uh, I hope you enjoyed this starter episode. And uh, please like if you liked it. And if you want to drop a sub, that really helps too. So, uh, thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys here in a little bit.